Morning, friends and relatives. Mrs. Joanne here. I have a book that's about mud. Mud. M U D. Mud. You know what mud is? Yeah, it's it's soil or dirt that has water in it and it gets nice and mushy and chilly and squishy and this book is by Mary Lynn Ray she wrote the words and it's illustrated by Lauren Stringer all the pictures are done by Lauren <clears throat> here's the cover of our book the front and the back and on the back it says yeah mud again M U D mud and see that? That's an exclamation point. That's when you write, you put you put the exclamation point at the end of a sentence or after a word, and that means excitement. That means you should read that word with excitement. You should be excited about that. Mud. Oh, I'm going to like this. One night, it happens. I can tell it's night on this picture. Can you tell it's night? Can you see? Yeah, there's the moon. And it's dark out. Maybe it begins in the warm of the day. And night only releases the scent. What else do I see in this picture? What kind of weather do you think they've had? I think I see snow. This is snow. And so here's the sun. And the sun's really warm. What do you think that's happening to the snow? I can see drops, little droplets in this picture. Yeah, I think, I think it might be melting. But it's always at night that it happens. Gee, I wonder what's happening. It's always at night. Someone opening a door will notice earth comes unfrozen. So it, it was snow. So that means it's been cold and everything has frozen. And a cold, sweet smell rises in the ground like sap in the snow. Do you know what sap is? If you, if you stand by a pine tree and you look on the pine tree on the bark, sometimes you can see this sticky stuff. It's kind of clear. Maybe it's maybe it's a color of a, a very light brown and it's sticky and you can touch it and smell it and it smells just like the pine tree. Just smells like the pine. Sometimes you can find it on pine cones on the ground too. By morning brown leaves loosen from their frozen drifts and run rattling in the flapping wind. There the leaves are. They're all coming out of the snow. Small scattered stones where the sun has, has seen them will thaw pools of grass. Everything is starting to melt. Can you see that? He's got a stick. And he's sticking it inside. And he's making ripples in the water. The hills will remember their colors. Look at what's happening. All the snow is melting away. You can start to see the ground underneath it. Winter will squish, squawk, sop, 
splar, slurp, melt in mud. Look at, he has his shoes off and he's walking in the mud. That's fun. That's really fun. Happy mud. Mud, mud, mud. Happy mud. He's got it in his hands. He's using mud like Play-Doh. He's making, he's making things out of the mud. Stir it. Stick it. There he is, stirring it and sticking it. Squishing it. Dig it. He's digging in the mud. Dance in the mud. Dance, dance, dance. Gooey, gloppy, mucky, magnificent mud. He is lying in the mud. Come spring, come grass. That's what we have now. It is spring. We have lots of grass. We have lots of flowers blooming. The trees all have their leaves. That happens in the spring. Come green. Come green. I think this boy really likes playing outside in the mud. I really do because he looked like he was having fun. Now, if you have a dog, some dogs love going in the mud. They love playing in the mud. And they get all dirty and they roll in the mud. It's fun. You have a wonderful day. And if you can get outside and find some mud, maybe mommy and daddy will let you play in it today. Because it's going to be a nice day. Maybe you can ask them. Have a wonderful day. I love you.